Uh, guys, this is this is the setup for this time. Um, we've got cutting boards over here, so you can see, you know. Okay, I really like that. That looks great. Um, and then you know we'll have the pans over here, which you can't really see as well, but we'll be able to show stuff off to the camera a little better. You know, like ten cameras next like time. Yeah, let's get like 20 billion cameras. First off, guys, we gotta start with the most important thing right now. We got our local Michigan beers. We got the vanilla Java Porter. It's one of our favorites. Yeah, it's so good. There you go, bud. All right, cheers. Get started. What do we want to start on? We need to uh, we need to do cauliflowers. Probably let's do the cauliflower first. Mm -hmm. um, so we need the cauliflower head, which I think is in the fridge. Yeah. And we're going to dice that into. Uh, I don't know, it, it doesn't really matter. We just need to dice it enough to get it through the food processor. I almost sliced my finger open about ten different times now. And I would have laughed. Right? Yeah, last time I kept getting really burned by this guy. Oops. I don't think he even cared. Your arms were in the way of my hot objects. <laughs> I am melting some butter, and I'm going to put that with the pecans, and then we're going to toast pecans, so I'm going to preheat the oven to uh, 350 degrees, that's good enough. Um, my water's almost boiling, and that will be for the cauliflower that I have half chopped here. And then we're gonna boil the cauliflower for about 20 minutes. Okay, so I just got the uh, melted butter mixed in with the pecans. We're gonna add salt and brown sugar again. Okay, on this side of the camera. So I've got the pecans, they're tossed in a little bit of butter, and then we got salt, a dash of salt, and we've got brown sugar. We're going to toast these for about 20 minutes or so. <laughs> Look at it. You got a little testicle. <laughs> so we've got oats here. We're going to add the applesauce. George is dicing up the uh, bell peppers for the egg bake. Okay, so we got the molasses, applesauce and oats, and we're going to add in the maple syrup again. We made these last time, I know, guys, but uh, we're gonna be doing a little different. We kind of alter them every time to see what works best. Yeah. Last time, I think they were definitely better than the first time. Oh, I fully them. agree. Are we still good on sound levels and everything, guys? With the uh, with the, the water boiling and the chopping, does it still sound okay? Yeah, does it sound okay? It sounds good. Sound good. Is it nice? What do you think? I wish that flung at you. Didn't even work. A little finer than that. So I just pour in like an an amount of chia seeds. Like I feel like that's maybe a tablespoon or two worth. I don't want too many of them in there, but they're healthy, so I just throw them in. Yeah. Was... Oh, got me. You okay? Yeah. Oh boy. Uh, go get a bandaid. Woo! Oh yeah, that was fun. I'm gonna highlight that, and that's gonna be a funny highlight. We get to laugh at them later. We could make it a gif even or something. I don't know. I'm gonna get the veggies into this bowl here. We've got the uh, green, yellow, and red bell peppers, and then mushrooms. We actually remembered the mushrooms this time, so that's good. I don't know if you guys have seen this yet, I'm pretty sure, but I think we showed it to them last time. Da, 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 da. Come on, guys. Star Wars? Yeah, you do love your Star Wars. Freaking love Star Wars. The trees are here for the moment. Jordan's calling his mom. The meat's browning up nicely over here. Um, the cauliflower should have been cooled by now to about the temperature we wanted them. I'm just getting these in a little bit smaller pieces, but it's not not a big deal if you even, you even could put them on there in full pieces because we're gonna drizzle the chocolate and a fruit puree over it anyway. So that will kind of just fill in whatever spots and kind of mix it with the bar. But the bars are gonna look really nice with like a more layered kind of uh, look this time. I should call my mom and ask her to watch us. Yeah. Should I call her up? I mean, if she can get it going, yeah, go do it. All she has to do is just click on the link, right? Yeah. That's on your Facebook? Uh, yeah, it's on my Facebook. Yeah. I'm going to call her right now. Go do it. Live. Go call your mom live and tell Dude, her you're on TV. Around. So my family and I, we always used to love watching the Food Network Star show. Did you ever watch that? Me? Yeah. Food Network Star. Yeah, it's this, uh, it's this show where a bunch of cooks compete to um, be the next Food Network uh, star. And basically, if they if they win, they get a show on the Food Network channel. Pretty fun. Is the premise of it. Yeah, it was a really cool show. 
we have a, um, if we can see here, we've got the granola bars with a uh, covering of the toasted pecans now. So this is about what we're going to need. We have a ton of leftover toasted pecans. I'm going to put them in a container. And those can be a nice snack. They're delicious. Just with a little bit of salt. And then we've got the uh, brown sugar there. Hey, I'm going to be a minute. And so this is what the cauliflower kind of looks like. Like I showed you earlier, it's definitely kind of like mushy almost. Like it's almost like a mashed potato or like a potato after you boiled it at this point. So, okay, you, that fits just barely in that strainer. Okay, this is hot, so I'm gonna leave it over here. The meat's probably about done browning. Oh, hey, my, my little sister Jessica's watching. Hey Jessica, how you doing? How is the new apartment? Uh, we've got the meat browned right here. Uh, that's uh, ground turkey. We're going to use that in uh, the egg bake. Mom, since you're watching, nothing has changed. I still eat all the meat before the food is ever done. <laughs> okay, so the cauliflower... Drinking will make it better. The cauliflower needs to cool down before we do that. So let's work on the egg bake, I think. Yeah. Yeah, we do the egg bake. Okay, sounds good. Um, we need one small mixing bowl. We're out of mixing bowl. Oh, we got one right here. Um, I'm good to pour these veggies in here, aren't I? Yeah, uh, just, you know, add as much as you want, and then ground beef as well. Uh, where did the eggs go? There. there we go. Okay, well, so far, the first couple streams, I've been burned three times. Hey, that was not my fault. Oh, wait, and yeah, now I'm officially bleeding everywhere, yeah. This is good. Okay, to, to be fair, I didn't cut him. He cut himself. I'm glad I quit my job and lost my insurance and then get cut and hurt. Seems perfect. Yeah. I'm gonna do it, Mom. I'm gonna make it. So we've got the uh, pizza going here. Um, I'm just kind of shaping it with the uh, the little wooden spatula here. What kind of sauce are you using for the, tonight? You know, I kind of realized we forgot to get pizza sauce, so we're just gonna make the crust. And the nice thing is, you can make the cauliflower crust, and then after you add get the base made, later. we can freeze it and add the pizza sauce later. All right, guys. Just so you can kind of see what's going on here. Just mixed it all around. Oh, that looks fantastic. Yeah, it, it, it's is a lot oh here, if you can tell. But this is good. this is gonna be tasty. One hey, thing is, we did not add any spices yet. And I don't I really just know what to. to add. Okay, so get the Himalayan salt, the pink salt, to the left, right there. Thanks, mom and family. They bought me the Himalayan salt. How much Himalayan salt do you want? I would just like grind it over a good layer over everything, just so there's a little bit on every bite. Looks about like a good amount. My family is, my mom and my dad are salt alcoholics. Really I'm not really, my mom likes, I, I think she used to, I can't remember if she still does, but like, put, put salt on a lot of stuff. I I don't even like a lot of salt on my fries. Any pepper? Right? Yeah, pepper. I would throw some pepper in. Oh wait, nope, nope, gotta season this Yeah, too. and there is a huge difference between sift and pour. I God. still catch myself yeah. not understanding that from time to time in the morning. Okay, I'm adding a little pink salt to the cauliflower. Just season the crust a tad. So we're gonna season the crust with a little bit of basil, oh, salt, nose. pepper, garlic powder, and I think we'll be good on that. You throw on in there as well? Yeah, throw it on the bottom shelf. Okay, so those are both done. Um, let's puree the blueberries okay. well um and then we can get those reducing all right, Take the water in them and all right guys here we go three two you know i think we should make our own jams too Ooh, i like the idea of making our own jams my uh step grandma makes a really good jam so we're trying to get this blueberry consistency guys to uh, a little thicker than this basically just by Cooking it on a little bit of heat. It's the whole time till the tower's gone. Let's get real close. So we're now gonna melt the chocolate chips into the reduced blueberry puree. Got this here. <laughs> My mom said she's still watching. I was, I was just curious, you know, if she was paying attention at all. And I was texting her back saying, oh, it makes me happy when that, you know, now that you're watching or whatnot, but and I accidentally put a question mark at the end of it, so it makes me happy. <laughs> I always do the wrong I, I hate that. Like, oh, this chocolate, melted chocolate with the blueberries mixed in here smells so yeah, good. Really good. Oh my god. I'm gonna start cleaning that. That's gonna be a pain. Yeah, just instantly clean that. 
This is how Jordan raised. It's really good. But yeah. Thank you everybody for hanging out. I'm going to drop that host in just a second, but make sure to check back tomorrow. Um, it sounds like we're going to start around 8 a.m. Eastern time oh, to yeah. uh, make bagels and make breakfast. And uh, we're going to do that. And then we're going to play Final Fantasy throughout most of the day. And that's about, uh, I think, where we're at. 